are in the are in Mevlana, Mevlana Museum. Museum. He was born in Bel in Afghanistan Salam. in 1207. Salam. And in the year 1221, because of the Mongol invasions, they fled to uh, Saudi Arabia, Mecca. And in 1228, they arrived to this city. And three years later, his uh, father died. And then he went to Damascus and studied there. In uh, 1240, he turned back. And four years later, he met uh, Tabrizi. Tabrizi, okay. Tabrizi. Then, but three years later, because uh, he was so devoted to him, so his lovers, uh, killed Tabrizi. His lovers Tabrizi. killed Tabrizi. Oh. That is what is said, you know, I don't know. Okay. You know. I, that is what it is written. And then uh, then he started writing his uh, poem. poem. And that is, uh, Mevlana means our guide. Yeah, there is a meaning. Nesnevi is his uh, book. Mystery. 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 Um, yeah, Mystery. That is written in Persian yeah. language. Mystery, yes. And uh, then uh, Mevlevi means follower of the guide. Okay. And uh, they do, then started uh, doing a mystic uh, praying. Okay. And uh, there is a sheikh that's known who runs the ceremonies. So people come in front of him three times and every time he whispers something then he starts dancing one right hand to the heaven and the left hand to the ground. He's getting the you know trance okay. from the sky and giving to the Poor. soil. Soil okay. To the earth. To the earth. And uh, later, his, uh, these things are done in many places, in Damascus, in, at Balkans, in many parts of Anatolia. But in, uh, later, in later, Atatürk forbid all the religious uh, activities. convents activities. Okay. And then this uh, place became a museum in uh, 1927. Since then it is a museum. His, his grave, his body, uh, his father's grave and his mother, uh, his son's grave also buried. Here. They are all, it's a kind of a family okay. uh, grave here. When he died, uh, actually he did not want something like that. Uh, burial yeah. like that, yeah. but later his son he built it. erected, he built it. But this mosque now you see erected in the time of Fatih, the conqueror of Constantinopolis, later uh, also Kanuni, uh, that's his, uh, the son of Selim, conqueror of Egypt. Egypt, okay. So they made a lot of donations for this place and it's been looked after by Minister of Tourism, this place. Uh -huh. And it's a, what I know, is the second or third visited place in Turkey, as in museums, after Topkapi Palace. That's okay. what I know. Very interesting. Let us see the whole view. So this is Marana Jami's place. Let me show you around. So what are these in the these back? These are the rooms that okay. the dervishes are trained. Ah, okay. After their ranks. Okay, still they are here? I mean, they are, you can see only the maquettes. Okay. You know, I mean, people dressed like dervishes. Okay. Uh, and you can get explanation of each room. And that's the kitchen over there, where they had the uh, breakfast. Okay. Dinner and uh, for the Dervish the people. Lunch, uh, for the Dervish. Okay. Very interesting.
Those who want husband, they come and pray here. Pray here okay. Those who want a uh, bride, you know, they come and pray here. You know, I mean, okay. if your son, uh, if you want your son a good education, you come and pray here. You know, I mean, uh, Yeah, in Saudi Arabia. Mm -hmm.